Now, wouldn't it be lovely to take a trip down to Park Rapids and enjoy a classic musical? Well, you're in luck because for this week's In Focus, Sherelle Moore has a sneak peek of My Fair Lady being put on by the Northern Lights Opera Company. You're going to see a lot of music, you're going to see a lot of dance, you're going to see a lot of, a lot of thought because it's a George Bernard Shaw play that was set to music by Lerner and Lowe. Whether you know the songs by heart or you're just now being introduced to the classic, the Northern Light Opera Company's performance of My Fair Lady will leave you satisfied. Thanks to the Unique Alley stage, even those who are familiar with the musical will see something new. We started out with this armory that had no seats, that had no lights, that had nothing. It was just wooden floors. And so we built, um, we started rehearsing right here on the stage and, uh, chore and choreographing things. And slowly we started building up the show while around us the, the theater was being built up. There are more than 40 actors involved in the production. There's also a live band playing behind the scenes. Audience members are seated on both sides of the stage, which has created some fun opportunities for the musical numbers. The choreography that you'll see in this show is original, inspired, but original, and um, it took hours, hours upon hours to put together. The whole idea behind the choreography was to make sure it looked fluid and natural. I had to make sure that we always shifted and we're always shifting. Yeah. It's always revolving rather than dancing straight to the side and to the side. I'd be equally as willing for a dentist to be willing than to ever get a woman in my life. Tonight was the opening night for My Fair Lady. There will be more shows this weekend and then all throughout next week. You can find show details and ticket information on northernlightopera.org. You'll just have a great time. There's there's a lot of movement that's exciting and will... And the music. And music and movement will draw the audience in it, and they'll be clapping along with it. Reporting in Park Rapids with this week's In Focus, Shrell Moore, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.